Assalamu alaikum my dear students how are you hope all of you are well by the grace of almighty allah welcome to NIEVS home school this is Shahja Diyakhtar assistant teacher of science of national ideal english version school day shift today i am going to take an elementary science class for class 3 students my dear students our today's topic <coughs> chapter 7 discussion part 1 our today's lecture number 1 and SW number 1 and this is first class for your annual term okay so my dear students let's start our class uh, follow this class with your textbook this is chapter 7 food we eat uh, plants and animals as food we short um, of food uh, do we need what short do uh, of food do we need why do we need food to survive okay so at first lesson one food and nutrition my dear students are given the uh, the classification of food and food from animals and food from uh, plants this is a box uh, here given food from animals and food from pl uh, plants here given <coughs> some name of fruits here uh, ghee eggs potatoes milk rice cauliflower roast chicken and bread now you have to find out which food um, uh, we get from animals and which food we get from plants okay uh, suppose ghee egg ghee we get from uh, animals eggs also we this food we uh, get from animals potatoes we get from plants milk animals rice uh, we get from uh, <coughs> plants cauliflower also plants roast chicken this uh, we get this food from animals and bread we also uh, uh, get this food from plants okay now go to next page we eat different foods uh, these common these come from different sources beef chicken fish and egg are foods from animals okay my dear students now uh, this line underline this line we get these uh, foods from animals beef chicken fish and eggs are foods from animals ghee butter and milk also come from animals okay underline also this line these uh, uh, lines are important for uh, true false and fill in the blanks we eat rice potato bread and vegetables as food bread is made from flour uh, flour is made from wheat so these foods come from plants okay so rice potato bread and vegetables we get from plants we also get fruits uh, such as jackfruit mango berry banana and orange from plants we get the necessary energy from food we get the necessary energy from food underline also this line okay uh, now food helps in our growth and provide energy for work my dear students underline this line again this is important line food also helps in growth and provide energy for work man and animal need food for nutrient substance that living things need in order to survive and grow is called nutrient okay this is uh, def uh, this is the definition of nutrient and you have to memorize properly this definition what is nutrient substance that living things need in order to survive and grow is called nutrient we get it from food now nutrition our food contains various kinds of nutrients our food various uh, contains various kinds of nutrients protein carbohydrate and fat are the major food nutrients okay my dear students underline this line and you have to memorize properly this line protein carbohydrates and fat are the major food nutrients vitamin and vitamins and minerals are major minor nutrients these elements are absorbed in the body from food now protein <coughs> protein builds up our body this is the function of protein okay protein builds up our body protein is needed to build prepare and maintain muscle and blood meat these are the examples of protein are meat fish egg pulses and beans contain plenty of protein okay my dear students now uh, we have learned what is the function of protein protein builds up of our, of our body protein is needed to build repair and mas uh, maintain muscle and blood and the examples of protein are meat fish eggs pulses and beans okay now come to carbohydrate carbohydrate are richly contained in the grain groups suppose rice wheat and maize okay 
these are the sources of carbohydrate carbohydrate provide energy for doing work this is the uh, function of carbohydrate and memorize properly the function of carbohydrate okay carbohydrate provides energy for doing work now come to fat fat provides energy and keeps our body warm this is the function of fat fat also makes our body fat is mainly contained in dairy products such as ghee butter curd etc fat also contained in oil uh, which comes from plants uh, such as soya bean mustard and coconut okay my dear students now memorize properly the function of fat and the sources of fat fat provides energy and keeps our bodies warm fat also make our body and fat is mainly contained in dairy products such as ghee butter curds etc okay now come to vitamins and minerals vitamins and minerals help our body to work properly and stay healthy okay these are the function of vitamins and minerals vitamins and minerals protect us from diseases okay these are the also functions of vitamins and minerals they are richly contained in fruits and vegetables okay now come to water water is not uh, a nutrient but uh, adequate safe water is needed for digestion and absorption of food in our body okay <coughs> now come to next page balanced diet uh, we may become sick of uh, sick if we do not eat different kinds of food in proper amount what kind of food we should eat to keep our body healthy the food containing all the essentials of our for our body in the required quantity called balanced diet okay my dear students this is the very very important question answer what is balanced diet the food containing all the essentials for our body in the required required quantity is called balanced diet the balanced diet is prepared by mixing various kinds of food protein carbohydrate fat vitamin and minerals should be present as per requirement okay so underline this line my dear students now go to next page <coughs> our well balanced diet is very important for us it keeps us healthy and strong the body grows well and the rich diseases becomes less we get proper nutrition by eating a variety of foods there <coughs> there is no single food which contains all kinds of nutrients nutrition we can still be unhealthy if we do not eat the right kind of different uh, foods we need my dear students see this figure <coughs> yeah, this is the chart of a balanced diet here given the fruit <coughs> green vegetables meat um, fish uh, dairy farms dairy products okay and carbohydrate also so this is the chart of balanced diet a responsible balanced diet <coughs> many people believe that costly foods have greater nutritional value but this is not true all foods contain nutrition regardless of the price though the source and price of food are different the nutritional value may uh, remain almost the same so there is no difference in nutritional value between local food and foreign food the characteristics of nutritional elements are also the same the, uh, the important thing is to select the right kind of food considering our age the work that uh, we do and how fast we are growing okay my dear students uh, your uh, i hope all of you have understood our today's topic um, now your sw this is your first sw sw number 1 and you have to do five you have to make five fill in the blanks uh, from this <coughs> topic and uh, uh, this sw you have to submit it on saturday my dear students i hope all of you have understood our today's topic properly memorize properly the definition and <coughs> do the sw regularly uh, see you again in the next class allah peace